<laughs> I am still so hyped that we got this bad boy last time. Look at it. Look at it. It's glorious. Absolutely glorious. Yes. And I also didn't realize how close I was to dying. I'm pretty sure I had one heart left. <laughs> Why did I do it? I'm so stupid. Anyway, today, as you can see, I've got some new things in my inventory. And I've got 33 levels looking pretty spicy. And that's because I have a plan today. And it's going to be involving using this. Because I want to make a beacon which allows me to, when powered up to a certain level, instantly mine every single block. I'm, I'm pretty sure. Obviously, I don't think we'll be able to do obsidian. You can't do uh, bedrock because you can't break bedrock with a pickaxe anyway. And I have a little story to tell you. I've been doing some work off camera, not a lot, but let me go all the way to the top. This, I've moved this and it still ain't working. So my, my goal for today is to get this working because I need loads of iron for this beacon. I also need to find a place for this beacon to go. I think I want it to go straight through the middle of my castle. because so I think that'll be cool underneath like the turtle sanctuary all the way up. And then it's like in the center of my, my main bit of world as well. So the haste will work everywhere. Um, what else did I want to do? I want to tell you what this chest is about. Get this working and... I've got an enchanted book here, which has mending because this bad boy right here, Lepic, is looking a little bit uh, hurt. And I was going to go ahead and get enough levels, which is 33, to combine it with a fresh pickaxe to be able to heal it. But I thought, why not just get a mending book and put that on it? Because that will be even better. That means I only need 33 levels once. So we're going to do that today. It cost me 30 emeralds from a, one of my lovely guys down in this pit over here. I've also thought that these guys over here, these iron golems, are stopping these ones from spawning. But when it gets to nighttime, let's give it a test and see what happens. Another story is I found the last cat that I needed, but um, I wanted to show you him on camera. So I caught him with a lead without taming him and attached him to this, and then he disappeared. Story of my life, he despawned. And this chest right here is the beginning of everything we need for an XP farm. Literally the only thing that I need are 17 more hoppers. Which is why we need more iron. <laughs> so when it gets to nighttime, which is going to be pretty soon, I'm going to try and get some more zombies up here. Actually, I should probably make a platform for it now, just in case it does work. Because I feel like the villagers are just one block too far away from the zombie. So, where do I put all my wool? I keep forgetting. So I need to make a platform for them to be closer. So let's grab some of this. I've also got a t-shirt for my zombie as well, which should um, <laughs> which should work. Hopefully he'll put it on. He is holding a, a shovel at the moment though, which is a bit worrying. I don't know how to get that out of his hand. And I also moved down that thing by two blocks. Two whole blocks and it's still not working. So my thought is, because it was working, the iron golems just don't need to spawn in because the zombie isn't like scaring the villagers. So let's see if we can fix it. So I just need more of this, I think. I, I, would, I don't want the, the golems to spawn on here, but I just want a place for zombies to spawn so they're close to the villagers. But I also don't want it too close because I don't want them killing the villagers. So hopefully this will be enough. I'm just gonna collect a load in here, pop them in and then block them in, if that even makes sense. Hopefully it does. Can this guy hurt me? Ow, here he can. Okay, let's not do that. <laughs> I forgot I had thorns on. So this is going to be a project for tonight. Let's see if that works. For now, though, let's create ourselves a beacon. I'm pretty hyped. Oh, and I also want to collect up all the cats today because some of you guys said I need the ragdoll cat. Some of you guys said I needed a different one. So I want to line them all up and get them in the same place so we know which one we actually need. Right, let's do this as well. Le pick is going to get mending, which is perfect takes all my levels and now we can go and mend this bad boy so let's go into the nether i think that turns it to night as well is that right or is that wrong because do you know how quick it is to get experience from mining quartz it's crazy quick i got to level 33 from level like 10 in no time i think i had some signs here as well i need to put some signs as to where all these go i think this goes to the cobblestone pillar I don't actually know where it goes from there, but I was getting confused, so... <laughs> oh no, what are you doing here? Stop that! Why is there an Enderman here? What are you... Ah! What are you doing here? Since when... Can Enderman... Oh jeez, there's another one. 
Can Enderman spawn in the nether? Oh, what a shot. See, look how much experience you get from this. I'm going to take off this just so that mending works only on my pickaxe. Because I really don't want it to die. Yeah, buddy, look at this. Oh, it's so good. No, 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 no. Ow! Where did that even come from? Oh, I haven't got armor on. I haven't got armor on. Okay. Uh, yeah, I forgot about that. Let's go. Let's get out of here. We've got enough levels. It's fine. Le pick is up to half health. Right. Let's go back and let's see. Hopefully it's nighttime. I'm hoping it's nighttime or at least close to nighttime so that we can get these zombies up there. It is. Sweet. Okay. We've got a little bit of time to do this. Where are the zombies at? I need some zombies. I'm actually going to change shirts. There we go. Oh, you guys need to come up here, please, for the big test. All right. This is going to be pretty scary for me because I'm going to be trapped in here with all the zombies. But hopefully this works. Otherwise, the whole thing is broken and I'm not quite sure what to do. Come on then, guys. Let's go. Let's get in here. Let's get all snuggly. Oh, no. This is a bad idea. This is a bad idea. Yep, this is a bad idea. Oh, jeez. Please don't let me fall in. Okay, you guys are dead. There's a little baby zombie too. He's so cute. Yeah, maybe I'll do this one at a time. There we go. Got him. Oh, no! Oh, why did that happen? Why did that just happen? A creeper's up there. Did it work, though? I feel like that, that should work. I feel like that should be scaring them. Are they not scared? Do they not care? Oh, man, this sucks. This really sucks. Oh, no. Stay back, beast. Okay, I need to punch these guys in. Yes! <laughs> Look at them all falling in. You're idiots. At least we know it works. So look, <laughs> it's like he's going down a toilet. It's great. He's still going. Spin, my pretty spin. I've thought of something that we need to do. And it ain't gonna be pretty. I think we need to feed the iron golems that we've got to the machine. I know, I know, it's crazy. But I think we've got to do it. And to do that, we're gonna need to put hoppers underneath. I'm sorry. It's, it's just gonna have to happen. Because none of them feel like coming in so you know what it's unfortunate but they're gonna have to die right so i need to start putting these down here because even though i've already spent the iron on them this is gonna well it's supposed to create more iron so hopefully this will work it should at least gather it into the hoppers anyway why is this not working i'm doing it i'm gonna i'm gonna offer them a sacrifice i, I have to do it it's without a doubt the thing I have to do. It's going to make me slightly sad, but I'm going to have to do it. Let me make a load of leads right now. I feel like there's six in there, so six should be enough. So let's pop that in there, that in there. Let's go grab them. I don't even know how we're going to get them out, to be honest, without the villagers all getting out. I didn't even think this through. How am I going to do it? How many villagers we got? We could stick the villagers in boats. How many villagers we got? One, two, three, four, and five iron golems. I'm going to stick them all in boats, and the iron golems are coming with me. This is a sad day. <laughs> Kinda. I don't know why I'm laughing. Oh, I actually have four boats already. How convenient. All right then, fellas. It's your lucky day. I know you've all wanted to ride in a boat before, and now you can. Yes, I got him. It's like catching Pokemon, but more fun. Let's just get you out of here. Oh, you can see my sweater through here as well. Look at him. He's like, what are you doing to my friend? Possibly brother. Maybe even mother. Who knows? There we go. There's another one. This is actually a really good way to keep them in place. I didn't think of this before. Oh, and they can get in the same one? Since when? Since when can you guys do this? That's glorious. Right. It's happening. The, rec the day of reckoning has arrived. So I need to bring these guys out, but also re-protect the villagers. Right then, fellas. You guys need to come with me. Look how many there are. Can you guys get out? Oh, I don't want to hit any of them because they will hurt me. Uh, right. I need to... I need to block these villagers back in. So, just give me a second, all right? Give me a second. Just chill. What did I just say? Can I attach them all to here? That's crazy. <laughs> oh, wait. I still have some of them on me. Maybe you can only do three on one fence post. Now, again, the reason I am doing this is because... I think they're already at the max of iron golems, even though they were spawning before. But this is like myth busting. So I, I desperately need iron golems to spawn. I need iron. All right, don't go anywhere, friends. Here we go. Here we go. All of you, come in this way. <laughs> Look at them. 
This is great. Can you guys just fall over the bridge? Or is this going to be really awkward for everyone? Come on, Em. Let's go. I feel really bad doing this. And even if we do this, we're going to get the iron for it, which is fine. The day of reckoning is upon us, friends. You have served us well, young ones. But I think you're going to have to go in here now. I'm sorry. Sorry this had to happen to you. How do I do this? I think if I just put like this and then jump over, they should come in. I feel bad. I feel bad. I feel incredibly bad. Right, there's one. I need your lead. Thank you. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh. Almost fell in myself. Almost fell in myself. Oh, I feel bad. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, it's happening. Go on, get in. Get in, you. Hey. Hey, you can't just avoid this. This is going to happen to all of you eventually. And all your friends. And all your family. Oh, it's horrible. It's so horrible. Did I get the iron for it? That's the most important thing. Oh, listen to it. I just killed five iron golems. I just killed five iron golems. How much did I get? I got five. Got some poppies. Oh no. I feel awful. But I also feel great. Nine iron. Sweet. Okay. Some more in here. I got 17 iron. See how lucrative this can be? Nuts. Okay. So if this doesn't work, I've just slaughtered five iron golems for no reason. <laughs> this has to work. There's no reason why it shouldn't. I've got no iron golems. I've got many cats, but now I have no iron golems over there, okay? Oh, friends, I'm sorry. It feels so lonely over here now, doesn't it? So lonely. So quiet. But hey, you know what? You guys are stuck in boats, so you haven't really got much of a function anyway. Protect. Attack. I, um, I'm sorry that I had to do this. We went from being protected by you guys, kinda, you didn't do that well, to now... Slaying your friends in the name of iron. I might actually have to steal these two iron ingots at some point, but for now I'm going to keep them there. <laughs> Wait. Wait a second, there's one more. You, you survived. Come here. Come here right now. You do not deserve to be here. You are not supposed to be here. Get over the ledge. Get over the ledge. I thought I was missing a, a thing. Ooh, I'm going to get stuck in there because if I get stuck in there, I'm dead also. Sorry. See you later. Oh, it's tragic. Play the song. If I'm not playing the song already, play the song. So sad. So very sad. <laughs> Wait, that's him. That's the cat. That's the cat. Have I got... Yes, I've got the raw cord. Okay, I think this is the last cat that I need. I sacrificed to the gods. And they, they pulled through. Hey, Mr. Kitty Cat. I think I need you for my collection. Please. Come here. I'm a good man. I'm a good man. You didn't see what I just did. Come here. Get out the water, you idiot. Come on. Come on, it's getting to night time. You're going to die. You're going to be in severe trouble if you don't just come here. Yes. Yes. Oh! I did it. Come here. Come here right now. Oh! <laughs> you sacrificed to the gods, and the gods pull through with this little beauty. We just collected every single cat in Minecraft and got a secret achievement. This is beautiful. What does it say? Tame all cat variants. Oh, yeah. Husbandry. Where are we at? That's the one. And the purple ones, I think, are like the extra little achievements. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, we got him. Oh, we got him. Let's just hope that my karma isn't leveled out by the end of this episode. Um, zombie's still in there. That's good news. But things ain't spawning. Just nothing is happening. I have one theory. I might uninstall Optifine and see if that works. Actually, I'm going to do that now. Oh, you have got to be kidding me. You have got to be kidding me. I just spawned into my world without Optifine on and it spawned straight away. Is that what was happening? Because now it's working. I can't zoom in. That's the only downside. Ladies and gentlemen, we need this iron. And it just worked. You saw it with your very own eyes. The only problem is I don't know whether it was sacrificing to the gods or Optifine that did it. It could be any of them. Oh, 
He's gonna fall on- Oh, jeez. Okay, I need to sort that out. Let's go. This is perfect! It's working. No, don't hit the zombie. Don't hit the zombie. You don't want to hit the zombie. Don't hit the zombie. Don't hit the zombie. Don't do it. Get where you belong! <laughs> Ow! Whoa! Okay, I forgot they would come up from there. All right, this is perfect. So, because the other reason that I need this iron so badly is for the beacon. Because if I don't have iron, I can't activate the beacon. It only takes gold, diamond, or... What's the other thing? Gold, diamond... I thought it would take redstone, but it doesn't. Iron, obviously. This is working, boys and girls. Let's go. So we should now be getting iron in here. Yes. So let's leave this running for a little bit, and then I can go ahead and grab myself what we need for the beacon, which is just one piece of obsidian, which I think I already have. I think I just heard another one land. Yes. Oh, I've got 31 iron already. What are you doing in here? This is an employees only zone. So I'm guessing something in Optifine stops this from working, and I'm not sure what it is. So if you've got an iron farm and it's not working in Java Edition, don't think this works in Bedrock either. I'm not 100% sure you'll have to check, but that's the reason. Oh, I'm so glad I figured that out, but it means I can't zoom in, which is really annoying. But for now, that is working, and that's all we need to get iron. So, let's make our beacon now, so we can start insta-destroying blocks. Uh, right, let's do it. Let's grab our... Let's put some stuff back, because this is getting outrageous. Call these beds. The villagers. I blame the villagers. Right, we need... We need some glass. So let's grab that. We also need three obsidian, which I actually think we have. Where is it? Yes, we actually do. Oh, that's perfect. So three obsidian, nether star, and the glass will give us a beacon. Can I have this, please? Give me. Give me! Thank you. So let's put this like this. Obsidian across the bottom. And then we put the nether star in the middle, grab ourselves a beacon. Do I get an advancement for that? I should get something for it. I know there's an achievement in one version. Yeah, construct and place, bring a beacon to full power. Right, so now what we need to do is make some blocks. I have gold. You can use a kind of a combination of everything. But I think iron is going to be our one. So, four I don't think will be enough. But we also need to choose a place for this beacon to go. I was thinking through the middle. But annoyingly, this is not symmetrical. So I could do it. I could do it through here. It passes through glass. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I want to do it through the middle of the the sanctuary, didn't I? Dude, this feels so weird without that mod on. <laughs> it feels gross. Oh, it feels disgusting. It's not smooth at all. But as long as this is working for now, I really don't care. Okay. Is this still working? I've got three more iron in there. Got some poppies going on too. Don't stop working again. Don't do that to me. Oh, you actually did that. You actually just did that. Okay, I need to make sure there's no platforms up there. Scaffolding, arise. We need to sort this man out. See you later, sir. Thank you for your service. <laughs> whoop, whoop. Right, let's figure out where this beacon should go. I feel like I really wanted it in the middle of here, just because I thought it'd be awesome. But I also think up the middle of here would be great and probably easier to do. Would that be great? Or would that be weird? Let me ask, um, let me ask Skinny Junior the second. Skinny Junior? Oh, are you okay? Skinny? Skinny Junior? Hello? Ah, yeah, sorry, I, th I thought you were busy, you are deep in thought. Um, where should I put this beacon, sir? I don't really know where to put it. Um, I feel like either in the, the glass at the front or directly through the middle. What do you think? Directly? Th Directly through the middle? Okay, I'm on it. Let's go. I think Skinny might be right, to be honest. I think I'm gonna put it in front of my my bit here, so where this gray cat is. Excuse me, sir. I need to place something valuable there. So let's just go straight through this. Right through here. And right through this. Cool. So... Just need to shut down this area for a second, guys and girls. Apology. Excuse me. Why are you... Hey. Hey. Behave yourself. Stop it, flappy arms. So the beacon has to go on the top. I'm hoping this goes through water as well. So the beacon has to go here. Do I not get the achievement for that? Hello? Construct and place a beacon. Apparently, I do not get that. Then we go underneath here, and this is where we have to put everything. It has to go down like a pyramid, and I think it starts with all the way along here. I'm pretty sure. Oh no, what did I do? What did I do? What did I do? I broke it. So we need to place that. Does that activate it? Oh, I think it's because that's blocking it up there. So I need to fix that. Oh, I've just realized this is going to mess up my, my staircase, isn't it? 
Oh, I'm an idiot. I don't want that to happen. So if this goes, yeah, it's gonna ruin that. Maybe if I make this middle bit out of glass, that would be pretty sick. I'm gonna do that. What color stained glass can we have? You can actually have brown, but I think you need cocoa beans, which we definitely don't have. That would make a really nasty colored light as well, which I really don't want. So we're just gonna go down through here. So this needs to go back to what it once was. Oh, see that skill. Absolute skill. That's fixed. And now this, I just need to go all the way up. Up, 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 up. Glass all the way up. We can always change this afterwards as well. So let's make sure we've lined this one up correctly. Then we can place the beacon down. All right, so now this is going to move. Please don't break. Please don't break. Please don't break. Please don't break. Yes. Oh, that noise was kind of cool. I like that. And this is going to go directly down here. Sweet. Beacon. Then the iron should go under here. So we need one, two, three, four, five more blocks of iron. This should work. I said that for most things in this let's play, but this should definitely work. Okay, I have enough. I have enough to activate the beacon. Let's do it. Here we go. That should activate. You could do it. Yay! Look at that. That's super cool. It makes a noise now. Whoa. Whoa. This is so cool. <laughs> it's like I'm being transported to another dimension. We still don't get the advancement for it. Construct and place a beacon. Bring a beacon to full power. Why is this not coming up? Is it because I haven't done something else? Dude, that's weird that that's not happening. Anyway, let's try and activate this. So for two, we get a haste and we can get regeneration as well. But I think we need to put one of these in there. So let me go get an emerald. We're pretty good for emeralds, so it should be fine to do that. Let's power it up and let's get haste. Now, I don't know how you get double haste because you can get haste too. And what haste does is, oh, that looks sick actually. As, if I change the color of this glass at some point, I think that'll look awesome. Maybe orange would be cool. But what was I doing? Oh yeah, emeralds. Let's grab, actually let's grab gold. So if we put this in here, power it up, click haste. Oh, we need a full one to get haste too. I should have haste now. There it is. Haste for 10 seconds. It just keeps regening over and over. Let me see how far away I need to be for this to work. So one has a 20 block radius. So we should be able to insta mine these blocks right here. Because I've got efficiency five and haste. Let's see if these insta break. Oh, they do. Pretty much. Haste two would make it even quicker. Look how good that is. Oh, this is a dream. Absolute dream. Is there any... Because the, the shovel is so good with efficiency five. Yeah, okay, that's insta-breaking. Oh my goodness, look at this. That's so good. You see on the top right, I still have haste. Is it still going this far? Oh, that's amazing. Actually amazing. I really wanted to get haste two today, but I don't think I can unless I max out. Is that another cat? There's a cat behind that box. I see you. I've got them all now, so it doesn't matter. But yeah, to get the secondary power, we need a full pyramid, which is gonna be ridiculous to get. Because <laughs> it has to be one of these materials. I've got gold. I've got emeralds. How many blocks am I gonna need? 164 blocks to be able to get the max beacon. Now that is a lot. That's so much. So yeah, we're not quite at insta break, but we're very, very close for cobblestone. Look at this. It's so good. Look how fast my pickaxe is moving too. I'm insane. <laughs> I so wish that I had this before because I need to clean out this whole area and it took me hours to be able to do it. But with the haste, Oh, it's, it's so much quicker. What else can we get? We can get resistance, jump boost, and strength as well. And I feel like you can stack them as well. Or maybe you can only choose one of these and one of these. But you can have multiple beacons at the same time, which is pretty nice. So for now, let's cover this up. We're going to need to make this a little bit bigger just because it's annoyingly non-symmetrical. But if we go and have a look over at this bit to the castle, it should look pretty nice. Oh, yeah. Okay. Skinny Junior, you were correct. This is the best way to do it. What are you doing here? Don't ruin this moment for me, please. Look at that. That looks so cool. So cool. Oh, wow. Skinny Junior made a very good call here. It was also through there as well. When we're in the house. Oh, that looks great. 
Okay, next thing I need to do is make some chests. I've got so much cobblestone, it's crazy. Look at all these chests I've got. It's still organized, by the way. Still organized. I'm gonna make those chests, and then I'm gonna come down to- Actually, I'm gonna go sleep first, because this is a bit dangerous. How are you still falling in here? How is that happening? Put that dirt block down. You don't have to use that, you crazy man. Oh, look, I can get shoes. I got shoes for my zombies. What was I saying? Oh yeah, I, could, I need to change these hoppers down here to collect it automatically, which should be pretty easy. So if I put a double chest there, and then move these hoppers to go like into each other, I think that will work. Put that into there, that into there, and all the other ones into there, that should work. Yeah, this is perfect. And shows you why you need so many hoppers for this to work as well. So now, anything that is thrown into those hoppers should go into the chest. All we need is a willing volunteer from up here, and that should work. This looks so cool in here. I love it. I've had another thought as to why this isn't working. I think that they, the zombie can't see the villagers now, so I need to make it slabs. But I don't know how I'm going to do it so quickly. There we go, that's better. I just made some quartz slabs so that I could match the white. Because I don't think there's- Whoa! Oh no, that guy's gonna die now, isn't he? Don't follow me off. I knew you were gonna do that. This guy's getting punched. He's getting punched so bad. Oh jeez. Okay, didn't think that through, did I? Well, that, that didn't work, did it? So I don't think this is working as well as it should be able to. So hopefully now they can see each other. I'm pretty sure. Oh, Booger, I've got a, a present for you too. Do you want this? Go on, put it on. Be a lad, put it on. Do you not want it? I made it for you. Dude, this is so weird. I can like walk over him and he won't hurt me. How weird is that? You did okay, maybe sometimes he hurts me. He doesn't want it. That's upsetting, Booger. Real upsetting. I want to try something real quick, but I don't know if it's going to break everything. Yep, it broke everything. It broke everything. Quick. No! Oh, jeez. Why did I do this? Why do I do these stupid things? Oh, no. Oh, no. I've messed up. I've messed up. Woo! Okay. Um, wasn't meant to do that. Wait, there's only two in here. One of them died. Where's my other man at? There should be another one in here. How many's in that one? There's definitely three in that one. There's one missing! Oh, okay, it's working again. This should be good. I don't really know what I'm doing with this anymore. I just want it to work. I wanted to test out the chest. Maybe I'm just not looking at it at the right time. But now, this should get you iron. Hey, It shouldn't be getting stuck anywhere. It's coming through. Every hopper should be empty because it's all going to the same one. I just learned how to Minecraft, guys. Are you proud of me? You should be. I wonder if it's more effective at night for some reason. Yeah, I think this is working way better. I don't know if it's a nighttime thing or whether it was the line of sight thing or whether it's because one of my villagers has died. I am not getting another one in there. That'd be tragic, but I think it's working. It may not be as effective as it should be, but I'm pretty sure it's working now. Yep, there we go. There's another one. I think I just need to get another villager in. It doesn't really matter if they can move that much because they can still both sleep and then they're closer to the zombies so they can get more scared. That's the main reason. Then they can gossip to each other then the iron golems arrive. So I should be able to- I'm gonna leave this overnight and see what happens. See how much iron we get from a night cycle of Minecraft. Okay, that seemed pretty successful. I had to sort out one of the uh, iron golems because they felt like spawning on the top. But let's see how much uh, iron we got from that. No, I will win this. You will not hit me at all. I'm gonna strafe you. Yeah, we go. <laughs> Let's see how many we got. Whoa. Where did you get that? Excuse me. Uh, where did you get that lead? Are you stealing from me now? Is that what's going on? I've got protectile protection on a... That's a good tunic. Wow. Okay. Uh, 30. Okay, sweet. Okay, 30 overnight. This should be perfect. It's working. We'll never need a, a more than a double chest there, I don't think. I think there's still a problem with it in the day, but I think that's because I messed up that side a little bit. I need to fix this guy as well because he is outrageous. But now that I've got these iron ingots, I can start making the 27 hoppers that I need 
for my experience farm. Because even though the nether is easy, I want to spend as little time there as possible, and I want to add mending to Lestab, and I think that's pretty much all I want to do, but... An experience farm will be good because then you can also instantly heal everything that has mending on it. Which is pretty much everything apart from my axe, my shovel, and Lestab. Because the rest all have mending on, which is great. Then I need to wait to have enough so that I can make an entire bottom of the pyramid. But that's going to take a while as well. But apart from that... We made some good progress today. I didn't need to line my cats up in the end, but I would like some ideas of what to do with the cats because now we've got the whole collection. I feel like we should display them in some way. I also need to extend this as well, which is also what I need hoppers and iron and minecarts for. Overall, today is a good day. Let's go and get a good view of our castle, shall we? Look at this thing. It's beautiful. All the way to the sky and beyond. But guys, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave a like. That'd be greatly appreciated. Subscribe if you're brand new as well for daily videos and to catch up with this series as well. And I'll see you all in the next one. Goodbye. What? Posters, tie swing, wagon, candle, canvas, sofa, fork, rubber band.